how to replace a lost or stolen passport. If you are a jet setter, then misplacing your passport can be a real downer. Follow these easy steps to replace your passport and get back on the road. You will need Form DS-64 Form DS-11 A computer with internet access An acceptance facility or passport agency Evidence of U.S. citizenship Identification A photocopy of your identification Money for fees And two photos of yourself Optional a U.S. Embassy or Consulate. Step 1. Report your missing passport immediately. This is the crucial first step in replacing your lost or stolen passport. Call the National Passport Information Center at 1-877-487-2778. You will be asked to fill out the form DS-64, which will validate your claim. If you are overseas and misplace your passport, contact the nearest U.S. Embassy or Consulate. Step 2. Begin the replacement process by completing the application for passport, Form DS-11. This form can be found online by going to the U.S. State Department's Bureau of Consular Affairs website. Step 3. Print the DS-11 and take it to the nearest acceptance facility or passport agency. Do not sign the form until you are at the facility. Step 4. Bring your DS-11, as well as a previously issued U.S. passport, a certified birth certificate, a naturalization certificate, certificate of citizenship, or current government-issued ID to the acceptance facility or passport agency. Step 5. Photocopy both sides of your photo ID on an 8.5 by 11 inch piece of paper and bring that along with your other information. Step 6. Pay the passport fee. Fees are subject to change, but you can expect to pay at least $95 plus a $25 execution fee. Call the facility to find out the acceptable methods of payment. Some accept credit cards and others don't. Step 7. Bring two identical 2x2 two two inch color photographs of yourself. The guidelines are very strict, so it's best to have someone who takes passport photos do the job. Step 8. Wait for your passport to be delivered to you in the mail and you'll be all set to globetrot again. Did you know? The Western Hemisphere Travel Initiative requires all travelers to present a passport or other identification document when entering the U.S.